If you ever find yourself in Topeka, the state capital of Kansas, stay tuned to learn all the best things you can do in the city. From the art and history museums to the beautiful state capitol building and plethora of opportunities for outdoor recreation, there's a little something for everyone to enjoy. Attractions Kansas's State House is one of the most stunning capitol buildings in the country. The architecture is beautiful, and visitors have the chance to look at the impressive murals painted on the second floor and in its rotunda, with some dating back to the 1930s. A free tour of the building's six floors and Capitol Dome should be at the top of any Topeka visitor's itinerary. Visitors can venture 296 steps up to the top of the dome, where they'll get a gorgeous view of the city from the highest point in Topeka. The building's dome is even taller than the U.S. Capitol. Another great way to learn about the history of the state is to head to the Kansas Museum of History. The award-winning museum tells the story of Kansas's rich past through exhibitions about the early settlers, the Civil War, and Native American history. You'll also journey through exhibits about the 1950s, African American history, locomotives, and more. Some of the interesting sights you'll see along the way include a windmill, a 1930 Chevrolet, and a biplane built in 1914. To further immerse yourself in Topeka's history, head over to Ward Mead Historic Site. Here you'll find Old Prairie Town, which is a replica 19th century town. You can step into the past with an 1800s church, general store, pharmacy, schoolhouse, and more. You'll even find a working soda fountain and large Victorian mansion complete with period furniture. Another interesting activity you can do here is have a hearty meal inside a charming replica 1854 cabin. When you're done, you can visit their beautiful botanical garden, complete with over 500 species of plants, a water garden, and a gazebo. To indulge in more recent history, you can visit the Evil Knievel Museum. The museum houses the world's most extensive collection of the Daredevil's memorabilia, performance wear, and motorbikes. You can learn about the performer's exciting life and also gain insight about the mechanics of his death-defying stunts. One of the museum's fun features is the virtual reality station, which promises the exhilarating experience of jumping over a long line of cars. Hey, if you're enjoying this video so far, be sure to give it a like and subscribe to Vucation if you haven't already. And stick around for more of the best of Topeka. Gage Park If you're toting kids on your trip, then be sure to visit Gage Park, where you can check out the Kansas Children's Discovery Center. There's over 15,000 square feet of opportunities to learn and play at this hands-on children's museum. Here, there are endless ways kids can explore, create, and discover to their heart's content. Kids can create art, discover different careers, experiment with science and engineering activities, play games, build towers, speed cars down raceways, make music, rock climb, go on a challenge course, and so much more. There's even a sensory garden and playhouse for babies and toddlers, so children of all ages can have a blast. Another place in Gage Park the whole family can enjoy is the Topeka Zoo and Conservation Center. The zoo is home to over 300 animals and was the first zoo in the country to house an indoor rainforest. Aside from the usual wild animal fair, visitors have the chance to see black bears, coyotes, sloths, armadillos, hippos, foxes, and more. There's also a children's area with domestic animals you can feed and a playground. A recent addition to the zoo is an exhibit that recreates a traditional Japanese garden, complete with a koi fish pond. For even more fun activities to do with little ones, Gage Park also has an aquatic center, carousel, and mini train. The aquatic center features pools, water slides, and sprinklers. You can also take a ride on the vintage carousel built in 1908 and explore the garden adjacent to it. In addition, the family is sure to enjoy taking a mile-long scenic ride on the mini train, which takes you on a course through the heart of the park. For art lovers, Topeka has multiple spots and opportunities for visitors to appreciate art. In fact, they have a First Friday artwork where every month hundreds of people gather to explore local art galleries. Also featuring food and music, you can stroll the streets, visit galleries, and meet artists. Even if you aren't in town on a First Friday, you can still visit the eclectic NoHo Arts District to view artwork and explore all the quaint shops. In addition to the art galleries, the Noto Arts District also has vintage and antique stores, gift shops, a brewery, an escape room, axe throwing, and eateries. Art lovers will also love visiting the Mulvane Art Museum. Featuring over 5,000 works of art and multiple sculpture gardens, there's plenty to admire. The museum also has an interactive art lab for kids. It features many different art mediums from around the world, but puts a spotlight on artwork originating from Kansas and the Midwest, with a particular emphasis on art from the 20th century. 
With 9,000 square feet of exhibition space, you're sure to find an exhibit that resonates with you. Topeka is also known for their large-scale public murals. This beautiful, sprawling artwork can be found in different spots around the city as part of the Topeka Mural Project. The goal of the organization is to install public art in places around the city that suffer from property damage and graffiti, as a way to foster a sense of community pride and mentor the artists creating the community-wide artwork. There are over 10 colorful murals splashed along walls throughout the city, and each tells a unique story. One of the most famous murals in the city is the Brown vs. Board of Education mural, which depicts themes of equality and inclusion. The Great Outdoors Topeka has much to offer for all the outdoor enthusiasts out there and those who enjoy being out in nature. Lake Shawnee is loved by tourists and locals alike and gets an impressive 1 million visitors a year. The lake has many recreational activities to offer, such as boating, fishing, camping, and even golf. You can also take a hike on the Lake Shawnee Trail and utilize the playgrounds, sand volleyball court, and tennis courts. One popular area of the lake is the Adventure Cove. Here, you can relax on the lake's beach, go swimming, kayaking, paddle boating, paddle boarding, or rent a canoe. But the most interesting feature of the Adventure Cove is their floating playground. It features an array of floaties in different sizes and shapes. You can leap off an iceberg, jump on a trampoline, float on a giant swan, and much more. Lake Shawnee is also home to the Ted Ensley Garden, a 37-acre garden with scenic views of the lake. The Tranquil Garden has over 1,500 varieties of plants, including a meditation garden, water and rock gardens, and an arboretum. The arboretum houses over 400 trees and 120 varieties. Another scenic body of water you can enjoy in Topeka is the 148-mile Kansas River. Aside from spectacular views, sandy beach areas, and hiking trails, you can kayak and canoe here as well. The river is also an excellent spot for fishing, rowing, and float trips. Entertainment and Nightlife In Topeka, there are multiple places to relax, unwind, and have some fun. Downtown Topeka has many great spots to do exactly that. Here you can go axe throwing at Axe and & Ale and go to Brewbank where you can enjoy regional craft beers from Kansas's first digital self-serve taps. If you happen to find yourself there in the summer, downtown Topeka has the Grand Energy Plaza, a place that regularly hosts live music and events. In the summer months, you can watch a movie on the 30-foot digital marquee, huddle by the fire pits, and catch a choreographed water, lights, and music show at the Crossroads Fountain. To indulge in great food and play some games, head on over to The Pennant. At this restaurant, you can try their signature burger and famous milkshakes, then head to their bowling alley and end your visit at their vintage arcade. For an interesting dining experience, there's the Topeka Civic Center, Topeka's only dinner theater. Here you can enjoy a delicious meal while watching a musical, comedy show, or drama. Another nice spot in Topeka is Studio 62, where you can create artwork, grab drinks, and catch a live show all at once. Now it's time to hear from you. Did we miss any of your favorites in Topeka? Let us know in the comments section below. And before you go, make sure you give this video a like and subscribe to Viewcation if you haven't already. Click the bell icon to stay updated on all our latest content.